guess it's locked. Yeah, I already tried. Come on, bring out the radio. Let's see if the triangle thing will react at all. Yeah, good idea. Maybe it'll dance or twitch or something. Let's do it. Come on. Radio time. Alex, really, I want to see what it's going to do. Are you going to make me beg? Please, Alex. Please. Let's... Oh, my God. Is this... Are you... Is this... You? Are you doing this? Should... Should I stop? No! This is awesome! Alex! Alex! Alex? Are you okay? You alright? I... think so? I don't know. God. Are you okay? Yeah, I think. Look, I'm just gonna cut to the whatever. Like, I don't know exactly what happened back there. But the sign says that's an old communications tower, and I don't know about you, but I want to climb that ladder, call somebody, and get the hell back home as fast as possible. I don't want to be the party pooper here, but the party just kind of... I don't know. This is kind of exciting, right? Exciting? Alex, we don't... To think something's exciting, you kind of have to know what that something is first. And we just got crapped out of the laser light show from hell, so... All right. I guess. If you want to play it safe... Never Hardened Tower. Oh, it's called that, I think, because the radio man who watched it, he was Major Richard Hardin. I don't know why I remember that. From 1941 to 1972, <laughs> Wait, the guy's name this communication is Major tower served many Dick different Hardin? telecommunication functions, including point to point from its receivers, <laughs> microwave from its dish, yep. car band it for satellite reception, and military air band for nearby uh, aircraft. I wouldn't go that far. Unique in oh, enough for nothing. I'm fine with a little de pantsing or whatever if the weather's right for it. But if this is some sort of prank or trick, I'm really, really. Jonas, what? You think I somehow teleported us here? If I could do one-tenth of what happened back there, I wouldn't haze the... 